Hello everyone from Inner Beauty Makeup. As you can see, today we're doing a very dramatic look. We're doing a cut crease, um, black and eye and white look. And we'll use a bronzy blush and very, very neutral lips. So if you want to know how to do this look, keep watching it. I'm going to start applying my Makeup Forever camouflage cream and this one it's number 13 so I'm just gonna apply that all over my eye to create a very strong base I'm gonna use my makeup forever eye pencil this one is a waterproof eyeshadow pencil and it's a white color it's color number 1P, so I'm just going to apply that right here, just on the center of the lid, because I want this part, specifically the center, to pop. Now with my Christine Dior 5 color Iridescent right Eyeshadow, I'm going to use this color right here, which is a very bright white frosty color. And I'm gonna apply that with my MAC 239 flat brush. Now I'm gonna use a small angled brush. This one is uh, from MAC. I'm gonna use uh, this eyeshadow from MAC. And this one is called Charcoal Brown, it's a matte finish color just to create that banana shape in the eye just to draw the crease and then I just sweep it up a bit Soften a bit more the harsh lines. Now with a pencil brush, this one is 219 from MAC. I just want to go with the clean brush just over this uh, color, just to soften the line a bit more. And I'm gonna clean that brush really well, and I'm gonna use uh, eyeshadow which is a couple tones um, lighter than that, and I'll be using Moleskin from MAC. I'm just gonna go over that color. And I'll soften a bit more. I'm gonna use a 224 from MAC, 224 from MAC, and I'm just gonna go over it. Smudge those colors together and now again with a small angle brush from my I'm gonna use this black matte color. This one I'm using is carbon from MAC So I just want to create um, Start drawing a line really really close to the lash line And then just sweep it up a bit now I want to sweep it up. Don't put any more color in this pencil. We're just going to work with what is left here. And I'm going to connect this black color with the crease color. And I'm just going to smudge it a little bit. Now again with the pencil brush with the same black color. Um, going to create a C shape right here and going to halfway towards the lid and we stop right there because we don't want it to be too heavy and then I'm not gonna pick it up any more color, just gonna 
sweep it in that brush in that line that we created above the crease just to soften that harsh line and then I'm going to pick it up my small angle brush and my black carbon color, matte color from MAC and I'm just going to run this color on my lower lash line to here I'm going to be using Naked Pigment from MAC this one right here and um, with my finger, with my ring finger, I'm just going to apply that right here just to highlight my uh, brow bone. Then with the flat, flat brush, the 239 from MAC, I'm just going to right here on the tear dot. And I'm gonna go back, come back with my 224 brush from MAC and I'm just gonna smudge all those colors together like that. I'm gonna use that um, black color from MAC, carbon, and just apply a little bit right here just to intensify that um, black color on the crease. Now with my 239 flat brush from MAC, I'm gonna use that white frosty color from the beginning and just apply just on the center part of the lid just to make that white eyeshadow pop again. Next I'm gonna use my eye pencil from Urban Decay the 24-7 the black color zero and I'm just gonna run it on the waterline all over it. I'm gonna curl my lashes and apply my mascara and today I'll be using Clinique uh, Lash Power Mascara and I will be right back. Alright, I already applied my mascara and now we'll be contouring the face and I used MAC um, Ten Tone blush and I use it with the angled brush from Sephora. So I'm just gonna apply that right here. And sweep that up towards the temples and for the blush I used Bojois I don't know how to say it I'm very sorry and this one it's uh, 74 rose umbre which is a nice um, warm pink color so with my Mac Travel brush blush I'm just gonna apply that right here for the lips, I'll be using the MAC lipstick. This one is from Viva Glam Collection. And this one, it's color Amplified. And it's a very nude color. And on top of that, I'm just gonna apply a little bit of uh, Smackbox lip gloss. And this one, it's a Candid. It's a gorgeous, gorgeous coral color. Alright, so for my dark circles, I use my 5 Camouflage Cream Palette from Makeup Forever. I use the first two colors right here. Uh, for my base, I use the Guerlain base. And this one, it's a Divi Nora color 440. I love this base. And on top of that, I applied my MAC Translucent Powder. Alright, so this is the final um, cut crease black and white look and I hope you guys really enjoyed doing it. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.